Hello. And uh, welcome back to Neo. We're still working our way through the DLC. Um, I'm not entirely sure how much we have left, to be honest. So, there's that. Uh, but I think my inventory is getting kind of fullish. So I'm just going to really, really quickly go through and remove a bunch of things from my inventory. So if you'll just forgive me one moment. What is the champion toss? Singular mastery. Interesting. Apparently have uh, all of it, I guess. So that's good. There. I'll call that good. I don't want to spend too much time doing that because I want us to start in on this mission called The Last Samurai. Fox Spear's Tail, Yamauba Spear, Samurai Locks, and a Stone. Sounds like some pretty good rewards. Alright, Hanzo. William, while Lord Masamune and the Date forces put a stop to the yokai, you head inside the castle. Unfortunately, this is where we must go our separate ways. I have received word that Yukimuro and the surviving member of the Senado clan have mounted a desperate attack on Lord Iyasu's main forces. This may be the final battle, William. As such, promise me that you'll make it through this so we can meet again in happier times. You got it, buddy. I will do my best. Erected in 1583, Osaka Castle was built by Toyotomi Hideyoshi in an effort to surpass Oda Nobunaga's Azuchi Castle. Its resplendent gold design, complete with countless treasures, inspired awe in all who visited the castle. After Hideyoshi's death, Yorogimi used his treasures to employ numerous ronin, with the intention of preparing for battle against Iyasu. It was said that alongside the ever-increasing number of ronin in Osaka Castle was an equally large supply of spirit stones, with a foreign woman overseeing the entire operation. Maria! Ooh. This looks dangerous. Don't kill Hanzo. He's our bestest buddy. It's too good for this whelm. Alright, let's see. So I swapped the Isonade to fight uh, the big chicken. I'm gonna swap back to our good, good peacock friend. Because I like having all the senses. Alright, what's down here? Bunch of dead bodies. And a Kodama. Remember, always go the exact opposite way that the map seems to want you to go in order to cover secrets. Thus is the true way of the gamer. Yeah? Cease your hand cannoning. Oh wow, good job. Yeah. 
Whew, got him. I feel like that was a pretty fair fight. Alright, um, what is that? Yoki, that's what I just killed. Yoki, that's what I just killed. Yoki, is it is it just another Yoki then? Oh jeez. Right, they do that. Forgot about that. So talented. So mad. He's so mad. Come here. Alright, that's whoa, so fast. Ow. Come on, I want you to try to Look at this shiny thing. Okay, apparently can't really do much to it. Whew. That's good. I had a I had a nice little experience today. I was getting a sandwich at the uh, the local store, and. Uh, as you know, if, if you've watched the streams for a while or not, that I own a motorcycle. And so, you know, nice day. And thus, I was riding my bike. Oh, or can freeze. This is good. Game. Why are you frozen? Ga game. Oh, it froze. It's not taking up a lot of CPU. It's just soft locked, I guess. What's what's going on here? Oh, this is frustrating. Really? Okay. Well, I guess I'll quit. Jeez. Okay, I quit the game, but I still hear the music. This is good. Let me just end the task. And then get started again. Sorry about that. Anyway, I suppose I'll complete my story while I, uh, while I do this. So anyway, I rode to the store on my bike. And so since I'm on my bike and whatnot, I have to kind of carry my helmet with me because I don't really like putting it on the bike like... There's a little, there's a little thing you can use to mount it onto your bike, and whatnot. But I don't really like doing that because I figure leaving your helmet on your bike is basically asking someone to take it. So anyway, so I carry my bike, uh, carry my helmet with me and whatnot. So I'm standing there at the uh, deli waiting for my sandwich to get made, and this nice, uh, this guy, this nice elderly guy comes over and says, "Hey, what do you ride?" And so I tell him, and he's like, "Oh, nice." I have a I have a Suzuki myself. I'm like, oh yeah, and he tells me a little bit about it, and he tells me about stuff about riding and everything. And then uh, he looks down at my shoes, and he notices he notices that uh, you know I'm, I'm wearing steel-toed boots, some pretty sturdy things. He's like, oh, that's good. Got to make sure to have proper equipment on. And he takes a look at me, looks at my jacket, and it's like, they're padding in there. I'm like, yep, it's armored. And you know, not approval and whatnot. And then we chat about chat about other people for a while, and about some of the things we've seen. All oh, right, this. All right. So 
So, hey, how's it going, Tromice? I just crashed the game a moment ago. So anyway, him and I, this old guy and I at the deli, shit, that's not good. This old guy and I at the deli are chatting about people and how they don't always wear the right thing and, you know, he's talking about a uh, good job, I guess, yes. I think I'm just going to die, honestly. It's probably going to be easier than fighting both of these guys at the same time. So I'll make an attempt. Yep, I'm dead. And anyway, the uh, the moral of the story about my deli encounter with this 72 year old man who used to ride Harleys and now rides a Suzuki, Suzuki, sorry, around is that pretty much everyone I've met who rides a motorcycle as well is super nice. They're just nice people in general. Even when they look scary, they're nice. So, that's my story. Not a very good story, but a story all the same. Alright, hopefully I can... Uh... Oops. Hopefully I can not... Oh yeah, Tromiser, you uh you missed me fighting a giant chicken last time. Of course the same with metalheads. Yep, I agree. A whole bunch of my friends are metalheads and they're all super nice. Yeah, you know, they'll kick your ass if they need to, but they're all it's very unlikely that they're going to need to, you know. Um, I wonder if I can trigger the uh, Bozy first. Probably. I can probably kind of poke him. Come here, you. Over here first. Come here. There's the roly poly. Most of your team has to relax. I remember I met um, I met a Mexican metalhead on VR chat before, and he was just pleasant. He was great. All right, let's see if the game crashes again. Because it crashed right here for no reason. All right, all right, no crash. That was really random though. I don't know why I did that before. Alright. Well anyway, let's take out this guy now. I forget that he has a bit more range than I expect him to. Come on, a little more. Oh, no, no. Ah. I was a little bit too greedy on it, I think. Just a little. Okay, so Yoki responds, right? And everyone else does. Yikes. Come on, I know you want to be friends.
Whew, okay, that wasn't too bad. Purified the area. Let's fight this thing again first. That way I don't have to deal with flailing things at the same time as uh, flailing arms. Come on. I know you want to do your rollout. Use rollout. Your Pokemon. Wow. Alright. Or that. That works too. Okay. Ow. That hurt. That's a crazy rolling. These guys are pretty cool. Like, looks-wise and uh, moveset-wise. That was a bit risky, I think, but worth it. Alright, uh, let's go slow burn on this. <sighs> They're really tough, yeah. They have a lot of health. That's, that's the one thing that I've noticed about this DLC, is that everyone seems to have so much more health than I do. And it's kind of a pain. Especially the bosses. Like, the chicken took a long time to fight. Alright, they're ninjas, maybe? Oh, yeah. We don't get normal ninjas anymore. It's just angry Yoki for us now. Wow, that has way more uh, range than I thought it did. Whew. It's, uh... Oh, hi. Hello. Ow, fuck. I just want to be friends of the wall and this asshole. Well, I don't like that lag. I don't really want my game to crash again, you know? Alright, hi. How about shoe? Oh, he likes it. Thank you, sir. Walter. Uh, lightning cannon. Ooh. I'm intrigued. Color me intrigued. Lightning cannon. Does it actually do lightning damage? No. It has... Hold on. It does key damage, though. Whoops. Key damage. Damage for flying bolt. Does anyone actually use these things against flying bolts? Because that's said to be crazy. Sound emits when it fires like a crash of lightning. Oh, okay. Makes sense. Alright, is there like a storehouse? Oh, yeah. Hot spring. Ah. Nothing like relaxing. Hey, this mission's called uh, The Last Samurai. By the way, I, I'm kind of. I'm kind of thinking this might be the last mission in uh, the DLC, but I'm not really sure. I don't see anything angry. Just because I don't see anything doesn't really mean anything. Ooh, there's a chest over there. Oh, hi. Fancy meeting you here, sir. Ow. 
Hey, how about we fight in the courtyard? Come here. Let's let's fight out here. It'll be easier for both of us. Man, the spin to win game is strong, huh? I feel like I do so little damage against people in general that I've been like actually swapping over to a uh, high stance way more often. Or at least way more often than like anything else. Uh, I don't know about this. There's some anger over there. Uh, before I go that way, I guess I'll go look to see if I can get to this instead. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Hi. No one could have seen you coming. Blood stained. Oh, hi. Right. You guys. Hi. What shall you do? The shoe? Okay. I can do that. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I swear. I meant to... I really didn't mean to fight him. I honestly just wanted to uh, dispel the barrier. Oops. My bad. My bad. No, really. Really, I wanted to be friends with the little, I think they're moles? The little mole dude. Okay. So I imagine I fight something here and get a key. What am I fighting? I imagine three arm guy? Yep. Slow down. Ow. Oh wow, the auto mod, what the hell. Apparently the auto mod doesn't like the word scrotum, despite it being a medical term. Ow. Give me, let me finish this fight and then I can undo that. That was really bad on my part. Oh, but he is low in key. Okay, now he's not, though. Uh, nope. Why am I... Okay. I'm sorry. Believe it or not, I have uh, I have toned them down a bit. A good deal, I think, too. But apparently scrotum is one of those words that they're just not okay with. Maybe, what about scrote? Is scrote not an allowed word? Ball sack. Oh, let's ball sack through. How? Okay, that's weird. Audience hall key. Whew. Hold on, let me just allow. Thank you. Add permitted term scrotum. You know, there's a sentence. <laughs> Never tells you to wear scrotum as their hat. That's good. And that's that's a fair rule, I think. Oh, that dude's just eating someone's fine. It's kind of hoping there'd be a thing out here. Hmm. This is on the other side. Oh yeah, it's right there. Wait a minute. Either that's the, either that little ledge is the way up, or there's a wall I can cut through. I'm just gonna try cutting first. Apparently not. Okay. 
and no uh, no rotating walls either, huh? It's been a while since we've seen those. I'm now like mildly paranoid that my name's my uh, game's gonna crash. Oh, hello. Wait. Oh no, that's a Yoki. Is you gonna come down here? Come fight me like a man. Like, come down here. Yeah, I know you're angry. I don't care. Fine. I'll just walk away. No, I won't. Alright, we're gonna kill him first. Oh boy. Surprised he doesn't come after me when he does that. There you go. Nope. Get down here. You know, actually, falling down, probably the safest thing I can do in this situation. Come on. Okay. So now the question becomes, do I fight big boy first or multi-arm? Uh, I'm going to go with big boy. Oh, it's a dual order. Hey, know what the uh, know what the kids say about this type of monster? He's lit. Have I seen the new Warframe trailer? I have not. Is it new as in new content or new as in like they're making like a Warframe two kind of thing? Watch this be another one of those little guys. Nope. Surprising. New is a new trailer for the same game. Okay. That's... Okay. So he's just the... Okay. I suppose, you know, you, you gotta get people in on your game. This dude's tweaking out. Did you just see that? Look at his head. He also looks angrier than other ones I've seen. A lot angrier. I wonder... You know what I might be able to do to him? Hold on, let's see if we can. I want to say I might be able to get a drop attack on him. Or he'll just stand there. That's good too. Oh boy! Alright, no drop attack. No drop attack. That was a bad idea. Nope. Nope. Ugh. Ouch. You see they're screwing out guys in just by counting the metal things that hold the chest together. Oh. I didn't know that. Oh, God. We're all the way back here. That's... This is a really long way to go. Or, I guess it's not that long. Like, we're just going into there and then going through. So it's fine, I guess. Excuse me, coming through. Gonna ignore all of you. Fuck! Okay. Can't ignore him. Oh, hi. I guess it's not as close as I thought it was. Teak with no rat, yes. Okay. 
I feel like it's worth it to bother the rat, though. Like, it's not that hard to tell what attack they're gonna... Or not attack, um... What gesture they're gonna use, you know? And they drop pretty good stuff. But that's good. No, I never noticed that. Okay, let's just not bother him. But let's take care of the... Right. How bad about killing stuff that's unnecessary? Well, you're just a good person. Get dunked on. Like Sif and Dark Souls always breaks your heart. Or Nito. Yeah, Nito just wants to have a rave party. That's all he really wants. And Sif is a good boy. Okay, so judging from my... Um, the magic meter thing was it. You can see it recharging right now. When it's pulsating like that, it means I have one, right? Because, like, last time when this guy was kicking my ass, I was mashing uh, my Y and B buttons on my controller to try to trigger the goodness so that I didn't die, but it didn't work. I like that he just, like, doesn't really notice. Nope. Ugh. I tried it again. But instead I just that. And now my death spot is in a really bad place. Oh, yikes. Fight a lost umbrella. Huh. Alright, so one Yoki, and then there's another guy. Fuck, right. Sword guy first. And by sword guy, I mean that guy. Oh god, lag. You know what? Never mind. I'm just gonna not bother with them. There is no reason for me to fight these guys. Out. His reach is so long. Although that one I definitely dodged into by accident. Sorry. Hi. How's it going, Birdie? Fancy meeting you. It's fine. All the uh all the DLC enemies drop so much Emrita. Can I just do that every time to these guys? Because that would be great. It's because the DLC is as hard as New Game Plus. Ah. I've been thinking... I've been thinking that I'm underleveled for it. Basically the entire time I've been playing it. And the other day I went and looked... Uh, I went and looked at a thing about it, and there are people who are saying that you should be, like, that you should have basically have completed a new game plus first before you do it, or at least through the first area in new game plus or something like that. If you complete the DLCs, you can just skip New Game Plus, go to New Game Plus Plus. Just go balls hard. Just go right to the wall. Oh, wait. Why am I, uh... I should get this. Sploosh. Huh. Neat. I still have yet to, uh, give the Abyss a try. Wow. 
This skeleton is better than like all of his peers. No wonder he's in this mission. Okay, the DLC is new game plus plus one. So you don't have to do the entire new game plus. That's nice. That's a nice little thing they did for you. Poking attack of death. Ow! Fuck. I wish that there was like a skill that uh, prevented you from being like stunned when they do their yokai well thing. Okay, nice. Oh, uh, did it just uh, filter out that link? That's annoying. I could have sworn that I didn't have any like. I could have sworn that I didn't have any filtering on links at all. Or I think. I'm pretty sure I had a. Uh, oh, maybe it's just Nightbot. Like I have Nightbot set to not to uh, whitelist YouTube links and stuff. Whew! Oh God. Uh, this seems like a bad place to be. I wonder if it's Twitch doing the filtering. Yeah, jeez. Like Twitch is filtering it, but Nightbot's whitelisting it, but it doesn't matter because Twitch is filtering it or something. I could see that being the case. Hi, dead body. Thanks for the stuff. Can you get a shot at him from up here? Oh, you totally can. All right. This looks like a good way to get a nice blow on him. Alright, here we go. Banzai! Ow. Now, was that worth it? Uh, a divine thingy? So that's kind of worth it, right? And another divine thing. And a dead body. But yeah, my... I'm pretty happy with my equipment right now, actually. I have a... Uh, it's like it's a plus four on my swords. Plus four on that, plus four on that, plus four, plus three, three, three. So, you know, I still got a little bit of soul matching to do, but I'm pretty happy about having plus fours on the... like all my stuff, pretty much. Okay, um, I have to assume I'm supposed to go up this thing and go up there. I don't think... Hold on, let me double check. There's nothing over here, right? No. Nah, nothing over there. Do, 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 do. Blink. Uh curious if there's anyone who's going to hand cannon me to death. Oh. This looks unpleasant. Uh, ye nope. Wow, yeah, this looks bad. Uh, we can probably lure one over here, though. Oh, great. 
that is literally exactly not what I want to do right now. Okay. We'll lure him over here first. Come here. Come fight me. Oof. It's fine though. Uh oh there he is. Nope. Hold on, stay there. Darn. I was hoping to try to get a drop on him. Hey, you and your spin to win. Uh you know what? Let's go over here away from your friend. I don't want to fight you at the same time as another one. Alright, that's one down. So now there's only two really bad enemies to fight. But I do have um, my birdie. Or rather Nobunaga's birdie that he has bestowed upon me. So it's probably worth it. I'd say I could take them both on at the same time with it. Oh, there's a fox over there too. Oh god, there's more. This is just going to be unpleasant. Next, please. There, nope, there's no fox over here. Hey, you, well, I still have this. Rat. I was hoping to be able to take him out with it. I feel like these Ronins got some pretty cool power having multiple arms and everything. Though if you've ever played a, uh, if you ever played Fate Grand Order. Then uh, Musashi, uh, Masamune Musashi, in it, her noble phantasm has a sweet ass four arm demon thing that comes and destroys everything, and it's it's very reminiscent of that. It's pretty great. And Noda, and uh, Oda Nobunaga has like a giant skull thing as part of its uh, noble phantasm. Good stuff. Ooh, a new longbow. You watch the anime. All right. So Musashi's just in the the game, but. Good stuff. Good anime. There's a there's a new one airing right now actually. Uh, it's kind of like a fate side story sort of, where it's uh, the El Molloy second case files, which is Waver from uh, Fate Zero, who was the master of Alexander the Great. I gotta go around to get that one. Looks like, and but it's him when he's an adult and working in the Mage's Clock Tower and stuff, and like he just solves random shit because he's awesome. It's, I, there's only one episode out right now, but it's been enjoyable. Whew. Foxy, foxy. The shitty thing is, uh, not, not about the enemy, but, but the zone right here. Is that those, uh, the two four armed guys were regular enemies, so they're gonna respawn the moment I touch this. So is that fox. Awesome. This is. Well, it's worth it, I guess, right? Yeah, so I don't know what I want right now. Could do more spirit. That's kind of important to me. And it doesn't seem like the skill is going to give me much to go on. So I think I'll, I'll go with Spirit. Having a little bit more time 
on our fights will probably be good. Uh, that looks very violent and unpleasant. I will save going to there. Alright, what's over here? Oh! Oh, I thought it was like a weird cockroach for a second. Ow! Oh, we can get... We can drop down into there. Alright. Oh, but I can't go onto that at all. Oh gosh, which way is the right way then? Well, it's the same house, right? So... Death by explosion? Explosion? What, did the poop explode? He was taking such a colossal crap that he died. That's what happened there. Also, there's a guy... Aha! Here you are. There we go. Okay. It seems like I had to fight whatever... Oh, hi. Good thing I looked up. Here, why don't you come over here first? I don't I don't want to trigger whatever that thing is before I have to do that. Come on. Next. Oops, missed. There we go. Yeah, that's uh it's a new season of anime airing right now. Or it's just starting. And it's been great so far. There's uh there's three shows in particular that have been particularly funny. And like really enjoyable, I think. One of them is uh, a bunch of girls trapped on an ow, on an island together, and they have to survive. And only one of them has any survival skills because her dad was basically like less shroud. But she like all whoa that was a um but that one's called Soninka or. I think it's just Sonon, Sonon Duska, um, and it's it's been funny. Like they're they're running low on water, and because they're they're currently they get started at the ocean when it's like a plane crashed or something. I think, and they're running low on water, but one of them catches a fish, so she wraps the fish up in her shirt, and then proceeds to beat it to death. And like squish it so that the blood runs out of it and whatnot, so they can drink it. How's it called? Uh, Sonindeska, I think, or I, I can double check. But it's something short like that. Oh shit. Ooh. It's, I don't know if that might have been a bit of a waste. But, let's change the god of Germany. Um, if you go... I want to say there are German subtitles for it. If you go to um, Erai Raz, so E R A I dash uh, Raz, R A W S, I think it's a dot com. I want to say it's a dot com. Uh, you can find a site that does a good number of fan translations, and they typically have it in a lot of different languages. Oh, you need a site that's legal. Well, I can't really help you with that one, sorry. <laughs> Yeep! I suppose Crunchyroll, or one of those, might have it. So 
so you could try one of those. Let me let me just get a hoop. Uh, I'm just gonna get the name for you, so I. It is yep, Sonon Deska. Here. Said that Los Angeles aren't even licensed all in German. Oh, that does suck. Oh. I love, I love good anime. So that one's fun. It's survival and silliness, and it's a short, so it's only twelve minutes long. So it's not, not a, uh, not too hard on like the schedule, you know. Then, wow, you are a mean fox. Wow. You're better than the fox that was outside. There, now I can actually see a bit. Uh, and then there's another one. There's the how heavy are your dumbbells, or how heavy are the dumbbells that you lift. That one's pretty great. It's just about, it's about a workout. Like, it's literally about a girl who wants to go on a diet and become thin because she's gotten fat because she eats too much. And just, it's like random... Um, like, there are explanations on how to do the exercises and stuff that are actually, like, legit. So, like, if you're looking to add some stuff into your uh, workout regimen, you can watch that one. <laughs> hmm, okay. There's a... Oh, it's right there. And then uh, there's Tejima Senpai. Or Tejima Senpai, which is a, a girl who wants to have like a magician's club. This looks violent. Um, that looks angry. He's mad. Ho's mad. This is the same. Yeah, okay. Okay, so you could avoid that and just go through there if you wanted to. Gotcha. Okay. First things first. Oh gosh, my aim. Remove him. There's two of them there. Yikes. Oh, I really wish that I had a... Uh... Wait, what? What the? Oh. Wow, you do a lot of damage. A lot of damage. I'm gonna try to avoid you and take care of your friend first. He has a lot of health, it seems. But he... He seems like the same old Yoki that we've uh, always fought overall, so... No. I'm gonna mind my health, so I'm not gonna worry too much about him, I think. Yeah, Tejima Senpai is cute. All these spirit stones. Hi. Oh, it just makes them. Okay. I don't like this place anymore. <laughs> Trinity 7. I haven't... I don't think I've watched Trinity 7. In, uh, in Tejima Senpai, the fan service is that she's really bad at magic, and sometimes that involves, like, you know, like, things like, oh, like, she ties herself up and then she gets out, you know? Except that she's not so good at getting herself out, and instead ends up, like, putting herself into rope bondage, basically. This isn't going well. But the, uh, the main character takes it like a pro, though. The guy. He's basically the straight man to her jokes. Wow. Okay, hi. Did I get worse somehow? A 
he has such a massive range when he actually uses that thing. Reminds me of the snakes. We need a breather. Yikes. Yeah, there, there are some shows that definitely go a tad far with things, but I mean, whatever. It's cartoons. <laughs> you know? So most of the time it doesn't really bother me. Wow. Okay. I need to get the fuck away from this fox. Oh god, why? What did it just censor you for? Nightbot. Relax. Or no, Automod. Okay, or you could be a magic douchebag, that's fine too. You've triggered the auto mod. Okay, what did it do that for? Oh, probably the... I imagine it's doing grab your boobs. Yep, it was doing it for grab your boobs. Like a bullying cat clown. There we go. Most of the time in anime, it's not the... It's the girls, like cat calling the other girls about the size of their breasts, you know? But like, I think the important thing is that, uh, okay, we've got to destroy that thing. Now, do I need to destroy all these or can I just straight up destroy this? There we go. It's destroyed. We did it. Holy shit. I don't really know how I managed that because it didn't seem like I had done that much damage. It looked almost like the uh, enemy killed it. Ow. Now it will be, be really shitty to die now that I've actually managed to do that. Okay, come here, you. That reminds me. I had a beer the other day called Sasuga. And it was pretty good, honestly. I didn't expect it to be. I bought it mainly because I was like, holy shit. I think I still have some in the fridge, actually. But I saw it in the store, and it was one, it was on sale. And two, I was like, ah, the moment I saw it, I was like, ah, I'm some, uh, and so I had to buy it and try it at least, at least once. Hi, little buddy. But it was good. It, it was, a uh, had rice, it involved rice, the, uh, distilling process. I imagine this goes to that staircase that was out front. Yep. Okay. Uh, I'm still missing some guys, though. Some Kodomas. Biro no mi masuka. Hi. Hi. Biro ga suki. It looks like on the map there's another little crystal thing. Alright. Skill? No. Is there like. Are there certain levels that give more stats than others? 
Because sometimes, like, the skill, it's all plus ones, and other times it's, like, plus threes. It makes me curious. Is this a knockdown thing? Nope, this is straight up go down. Alright, so we have a go down, or we have... Okay, we have a go down. Okay. This is a... Uh, well, this was a nice castle. I'm gonna... Oh, okay. Oh, well now I know the way there. Ow. I released just a little bit too late. There's really no reason for me to take that damage. I'm just dumb. Okay, I think that's the only way I can go. Oh boy. Okay, see, he's mad. Wait. Destroying those is like lighting that thing up. Why is that happening? Oh boy. Destroy my frame rate! <laughs> that did not work. <laughs> I'd imagine I'm going to die. It's fine, though. <laughs> ah, that guy had a twitch fit. I don't like these things. These big crystal uh, summoning chambers. Not even my rifle does enough damage to kill him. There we go. That was a much better execution of what I wanted to do last time. What? Was I... What? Did I die in, like, two hits there? Hold on. What just happened? Do you take damage if you're inside of that summoning chamber? I just want my guy back. That's all I want. I, I just want my birdie back. God, I've like summoned the horde. Hi, bye. No, don't target that. Wait, what? Wait, I did get my bird back. Okay. Okay. What about if I destroy all of these. God, there's so many of them. There's out. Does anything good happen if I do that? Doesn't seem like it. What was that? Okay. That's one guy down. Oh, okay. So it's gone now. I'm not sure of destroying... 
Was destroying all of the, uh, the thing who's it's what did it? Shit, that's not what I wanted. I wanted this move. Hey, come here. Come here. We're fighting. I get a sneak attack on them? Do you think sneak attacks or sign of the crosses do more damage? Wow. I know that does damage. Really? You are too smart for your own good. Or you're not smart at all. Depends entirely on your build. Okay. Well, let's see here. So that's the damage that I did to him with uh, the what's call it, and here's the sign of the cross. Oh, I think it's sign of the cross time for me. So that's good to know. Uh, can I open this? Nope. Oh no, there's a little guy inside. Oh no, there's there's just a treasure. Never mind, there's treasure inside. I don't care as much anymore. Really good sign of the cross builds. That's what uh my friend who originally like recommended the game to me, his build I think was a sign of the cross build where he wore the uh like the master's armor. What the I hear you. Are you up there? Or down there? Oh boy. I hear the code, my buddy. Wait, that dude just winked out of existence. Okay. These spirit zones are just bad. Whoa! Nice, uh, nice timing on that. Okay, you can stay over there. I like these guys, the ones who have a uh, like one dagger sword thing and then the hand cannons. They're a lot easier to fight than the Kusurai Gama ones. Okay, so that's two. The real question is where's the rest of them? Oh, there's that one I suppose. Okay, there we go. So you gotta destroy those first. Yeah, I'm in for a bad time, alright. Get the fuck out! That's all these spirit stones. How much can I lure them away from each other? God, 
this camera. Okay, I think this worked. I think only he came this time. He seems tired. Also, don't know if you noticed, but I've gotten this thing's timing down a whole lot better. Ooh, okay. Which one to fight Hurst? Also, does um does using the spirit stones or soul stones, sorry, soul stones. Do these things re uh like recharge my um I don't know what to call it. The meter for my living weapon at all. Like, because you collect Amrita from fighting people and it kind of charges the gauge, right? So if I if I were to use, like, a small spirit stone. Aha! I feel like that's worth doing. Because these guys are such a pain in the ass to fight. Be, be afraid of my birdie. <laughs> now, am I wasting my living weapon a little bit? Maybe. Oh wait, aha. Here we go. Shortcut unlocked. Is there a way to stop your living weapon once you use it? Like, so you can like hold on to any of it? Aha, I bet you the Kodama is up here. Or you sheathe it. Ah. He's gonna kill me. Fuck. Okay, where am I right now? Sheathing your opponent deactivate. Okay. That is good to know. I will do that next time. Oh, it still resets the gauge. Okay. Okay, so there's a Kodomo buddy right there. So I think, I think I don't want to do that. You think not? All right, well, we'll test it. We'll test it and we'll find out. Oh, goodies. I'm curious if there's anything over here, though. Hi. I don't know why, but I was just like, spider? Spider. Maybe because it's just a cave. I figured I'd be on the, out on the lookout. Though I don't... I don't think I've seen a single spider this whole DLC. I think. Uh... Mm, no, that might have been a submission. Never mind. I was going to say there was a boss rush that uh, I did. Oh boy. Okay. This ain't it. Goody. Ow, fuck you. Listen, douchebag. Oh, I can't aim that low. He I hear it. I hear a code I thought. I 
Like crazy? I hear one. And the there's a little dot on the map there. There you are. Okay, how do we get there? Stairs? Yeah, okay, I can't just hop over there. Oop, oop, that's not the way. And it's not open at all, it's cut off by the staircase, okay. So we gotta go back, go up, and probably up and around, I think. That would make some sense. Yep. Uh, yep, okay, fuck that. And... Oh, nope, not fuck that. I have to... I gotta do that first. Alright. I'm totally okay with spamming my, uh, my living weapon a bit. Because that looks... This looks bad. Yeah, no. Firepower. Oh, it's you. Oh boy, and you do so much damage. Hey, thanks. Appreciate it. Everyone's dropping spirit stones like mad. Okay. Um, let me try to remember. How do you fight this guy? Carefully, probably. I think we'll do careful. And we'll still fuck it up sometimes. He has nice music though. It's kind of relaxing. I like that I missed pretty much every single one of those hits. Ow. It's always fun when you get to fight someone who uses the same weapons as you. You get to know their moves. It's like, haha, you cannot beat me, for I know all that you do. It's just a matter of who does it better. Ow. In that case, most of the time it's the boss. But, oh, jeez, okay. Not a second one, though, huh? He seems pretty easy as long as you're staying close. It's those dash attacks that are doing me. So like we're we're taking our sweet time here, but I think it's probably probably the best way to go about it. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, okay. You know, I thought we were having a friendly competition, and you gotta bring ranged magic bullshit into this. Ow, that hurt. I'm still gonna follow the same strategy though. Like his moves are still the same.
So what do those uh what do those spirit stones do anyway? Like were they charging him up at all or anything like that? Cause I figured I'd just destroy them first just because Ow. Fuck! Wow! One hit if I'm not blocking. He gets life regeneration. Oh. Hold on. Wait, why is this? Okay. I thought I opened that door. I guess I opened a different door. Which door did I open? Oh, I hear, I hear some mad people. I opened that door. Nope. Don't care. Oh, you know what I probably should have done? I probably should have used some of those spirit stones. And gave myself, uh, you know, some living weapon to go to town on him when he gets close to the end. Ooh, boy. Which uh, which effect was it? The particle effect you're talking about? That did not work out as well as I wanted to. He's gonna get me, isn't he? Ow, fuck. Fuck, he's gonna get- Whoa! Oh, 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 that was damn close. Nope. Nope. Oh shit, moving I moved too far away from him. Nope. Please do not stab me, sir. Oh, this again. Nope. See, this is this is where I would use a living weapon if I had one. Energy shock with it makes like double layers and sitting and that will have any energy fluctuations. <sighs> that does sound good. That was that dodge was insane. Oh gosh. The one where he did like three uh three stab attacks in a row. That was madness. I can't believe I actually dodged that. Oh wait, I should probably use some of that Amrita. Don't know, I still don't understand that. Wow, I have enough for two levels. Sure, let's do that. You got hit by everything. <laughs> I mean, that's the best way to learn, right? The best way to learn how to dodge the attacks is to get hit by them first. 
Okay, that's another Kodama. So that's good. Um, let's see here. So this was that. And this is that. Uh, we're just dying we do it until you get lucky. Yeah, I felt like that's how it was against the chicken. The, uh, Omro um, or something? The big chicken. Wait a minute. What is this? You know, I don't like the looks of this. I feel like this looks more like the end of a level than it does the uh, start. Especially since the thing's right there. Oh wait, now I'm confused though. This is, isn't this where I came from? Oh god, I'm so confused. I just don't want to accidentally end the level. Wait, no, okay, okay. Right, this is, this is where I came from, right? Wait, maybe not. Okay, that's the courtyard. That's the angry guy. That's the yeah. Okay, okay. We we are here. Okay. Yes, sir. You won't actually. Yeah, okay. Thanks. It's just it's confusing. I get lost sometimes. So that's that. We go up. Especially since I haven't found all the Kodamas yet. Which is throwing me off another boss, really. Oh boy. Whew, okay. Let's uh let's be smart this time. Use a couple spirit stones. Oh there's there's an enemy in here. I think. Maybe he's on the other side of the wall. Okay, let's see how long can I go without triggering it. Ishida Mitsunari. Um, who is that? That's not Mitsunari. Oh, that is him. Have fun, thanks. Okay. Yeah, okay, I remember fighting you, I think, but last time... Last time he had two swords, didn't he? Ow. Bad. Woohoo! Worth it. Okay, this isn't... This isn't the uh, one-eyed dragon, is it? Like, that's... Someone else? Nah. Okay, where did I fight him before? Because I know I fought him, right? Wait, was this the guy I fought, like, in the top of a castle? Normal games. Okay, he didn't look like this, though, did he? With the crazy tail and whatnot? On top of the mountain. Yeah, he's... Yeah, he has the bullshit. That's right. That dragon is bullshit, if I remember right, because it kills you in, like, one shot. What? Ow. What What was that? What was that? <laughs> I couldn't see because of the... because <laughs> of the wall. What did he just do to my poor corpse? Okay, then. So, this is just boss rush mode, basically. Is what this is. Okay, give me my bird back. We're at halfway. Sure. You know what? Let, let's let's use these. I don't know what I could use them for, but I could use them for something. Maybe. 
uh, small, so stun. Okay. Burp. Learn skills. There we go. I have enough to increase my melee attack. So I can do that. That's a good idea. And then... Magic-wise... Isn't there a thing... That's Thundershot. There's a thing about elixirs, right? Oh, I can't do any more than that. Shoot. I was hoping to get more. Alright, what about down here? That's capacity. Eh, okay. Well, I have an idea of how I'm going to fight him. Just you wait for my awesome strategy. And it involves wrecking his key. See? Wreck his key. And then go to town. That was facing the wrong direction. What? No! That is such bullshit! <laughs> that is a lot of bullshit right there. Okay, so you have to dodge that. If you don't dodge that, you die. Dash into him when he does that? Okay. Ow. It was a bit... Wait, that's like really directional. That's like only in front of him. Can he only do it when he takes his bird out though? That's the question I have. Oh, sorry, buddy. Okay, no! I tried dashing into him. I tried. Is it a... Uh, do you have to time it so you dash forward like as he's about to grab you? Or would it be better to dash away? I think you did a bit too soon. Okay. Fuck you, <laughs> You usually roll underneath them, okay. You can also slice it. What if I just use my living weapon? <laughs> I had, his health was going down pretty fast there. I think fire does a lot of damage to him. It almost makes you want to like swap uh, living weapons to a fire one. Almost. Mm. 
Ow. Yeah, nope. Didn't work. I always, I'm seeing it like a little bit too late. It's a pretty quick move. I feel like it's only like a second and a half or so between like when he starts it and when he actually gets you. So I'm gonna have to do better about actually watching him. Also, I forgot to light my sword on fire right beforehand. That's a decent range as well. Ow. They, wow, there was no reason for me to get hit by that at all. That's just my own damn fault! Yeah. <laughs> that move... That move is going to be the bane of my existence. I can already tell that. Okay, I'm gonna swap the rejuvenation with the life seal so that everything I need is right there. And then put the uh, rejuvenation on that one. Yeah, there we go. He really just like puts you down. He's like, oh, you wanted a boss fight? How about I just murder you instead? And it'll be great. You'll love it. Let's just go ham. Let's see how far we can go with this. I was half expecting him to just slap me down right there. Okay, that's good. Do it again. No, no. Oh yes. Whew. Got him. The slapper has been slapped. Whew. Living weapon spam for the win. Wow, okay. Oh, there's the Oh no, that's just a thing. What if this like respawned him? Wouldn't that just be complete ass? <laughs> Heart. Nah. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay. That's weird. Okay. Now I'm confused. There's, there's more stuff over there. Is there a hidden wall I don't know about? Or a wall with eyeballs? So I'm feeling like I'm missing stuff here. Yeah, well, let's explore out here, I guess. So there's a, what looks like a down path, kind of. Though any real path is kind of hard to see at all here. Maybe this way? Oh, hi. Hey. Um, how you doing? <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> He's got friends in high places. 
Come here. I promise to be friends if you come here. Granted, every single one of Anjin's friends he's dueled before, so this is just a, a test of friendship. That's all this is. Hi. Oh no. No, 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 no. Okay. It's like after all that, don't let me die from this guy. It is Chacha. Chacha is a, a berserker servant in Fate Grand Order. And she's pretty great. Um, hmm. This looks like I'm heading towards another boss. I'm going to head the other way first. To see if I can get to where I thought there was a Kodama. Maybe I can't actually go this way? No, okay. That's so weird. See, like, down, down where there's all a bunch of pillars and whatnot, it really seemed like there was another one. Maybe I have to get a key from a boss and then I can open up that and then I can get it. Just double checking, this is, yeah, okay. All right, what uh, what am I up against next here? Something angry. From the looks of it. What was that? Too soon. Okay, that looks like a boss door. Ignoring it. Ooh, hi. Hey, little code of my buddies. Uh, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. All right, so probably it's gotta be a boss after those doors. So let's see if this leads down at all. I hear Kodama. Down this way, maybe? Oh. Okay. Why? Why? For what purpose? Okay, there's, there's clearly a Kodama here, though. Like, he's on the map. He's right there. He's, like, in this room or something. So maybe it's not a boss? But, like, this is this is a boss door. Is the Kodama in the boss room? That's, uh... That's some cool armor. I think that was a very impolite... Oh, he totally is. <clears throat> Hold on. No, no, I'm not fighting you yet. I'm trying to find a friend first. Excuse you. Maybe he's a mid-boss. Alright, listen, Hidayori. 
you're not nearly as cool as Hideyoshi. So, I'm going to have to ask you to die. Oh, you used more than one style of weapon. Look at you. And yet, you still get impaled. Cool story. Ouch. At least it doesn't one-shot me. Okay, I should have dodged away. That was my fault. Is is he a mid-boss? Like, do I get to... Uh, does he end the level after I fight him? Or do I get to wander around afterwards? Because, like... There's a, there's a locked door, you know? Also, I totally had to fight those really angry guys again, don't I? Or do I... Wait, no, why would I... Wait, I don't need to do this. What am I doing? Excuse you. Ow, fuck me. Like, why? I don't, I don't need to fight them. We're good. Let's not worry about it. Alright, so he uses fire. So that makes me think... I kind of wish that I had my shark with me. move. Okay. So yeah, I, I'm just gonna run by. There is absolutely zero reason to pay any mind to that guy. Thing is, I, I feel like I've done a pretty good job of fighting, like, pretty much everything. So it's gonna be slightly weird to me. Fuck, not fast enough. Uh. Shit, that isn't what I wanted to do. I wanted to use this. Nice sign of the cross. Too bad your ass got sassed. Hmm. That doesn't do that much damage. But luckily, his key is garbage because of my wonderful magic. Shit, dodge that. That was so fucking close. Okay, I don't have any more things to attack his key with. That was probably a bad idea. Yeah, that was a terrible idea. Why, oh why, did I think that that was a good idea in the moment? Okay.
Nope. 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 Eat all my nope. I still haven't used my uh, living weapon on him yet. But I'm gonna. I figure I can knock his key down and then use it. That's kind of what my thought is. My key is too low there. That hurt. Is that like a counter move or something? Like it doesn't he doesn't actually do anything with that one. Also, I have no idea, and I wish I understood this. Why do my why does my living weapon sometimes have things like this and other times it doesn't? Oh boy. Okay. Ow, shit that hurt. Okay, I don't like this new Ooh. That's the, the entire field is water. It's like the floor is lava but different. I hate it. Like, look at this. Cool move. I could do that too if I wanted to. Okay, so he's got like all element elements just like Nobunaga did, basically. Ow. And I'm on fire again. That did way more damage than I expected it to do. Ow, dick. Mm, God, I'm gonna die because of the fire damage. Ow. Jeez, the entire, wow. He can span the entire, uh, entire map. That's good. have an idea. So he uses fire. 
He uses fire and water. Well, maybe wind is good then. I don't know. I don't know if there's any kind of like element stuff, you know, where like. Because sometimes it seems like fire damage does really well against certain people, right? Like against the wind boy, fire did good. So, like against water guy, I would think that lightning would be good. But fire, I. I would think water, so... Because, see, all I really want to do is just keep his key so low that he can't do anything. Does he, does Anjin only roll if uh, you sheath your weapons? I feel like his sign of the cross is better than mine. Damage wise. Lightning, I'm slowed. Let's just wait for that to uh, wear off, shall we? I kind of want to shoot him in the face, like when he does that move where he kind of like readies himself for a counterattack. effect on that. Ow. I really wish that uh, I had a living weapon right now. Yeah, when he does that. Oh, he just regained health. I don't like that. I don't like that he just regained health. Whoa, okay. That's new. 
Jeez, what was that? Ow. God. Okay, then. So the real question is, when am I going to get a moment? Ow. Fuck. Nope. Well, it was either die from an attack or die by, like, lightning damage. I don't think I really had a way out of that one. Man, this guy is hard. I'm trying to think of uh, how I could do it. Like, we could try to cheese the first part of the fight a little bit by shooting him in the face repeatedly. Because then we would have more elixirs over time. Once he goes like yokai on us, though, I feel like we could throw salt at him to get rid of his key. And I forgot to enchant my weapon. Alright, give me a moment. I kind of want to think about using a different uh, guardian. Don't get me wrong, I love my burb. But I'm wondering if... Because Isanade has close combat life recovery, which is handy. Plus gives me more life. Attack enhancement isn't as big though. Hmm. I don't know, man. The close combat life recovery is nice, though. But that's oh, that's only for defeating them, so that's not as important. It, and I, it is human close combat damage. High stance, increased attack. Mid stance, increased defense. Low stance, increased key recovery speed. Oh, good to know. Oh, well, the other thing I could do is uh, my secondary spirit. It is currently uh, Sirsa. We could swap that to someone. Uh, I don't really need key reduction, though. Key plus, equipment drop rate, life. Life could be helpful, maybe. Attack the behind, not going to help break. Life recovery from purification. That almost seems possibly useful. Close combat attack key reduction. Yeah. <sighs> Pierce guard close combat. Inflicts the damage even when enemy guards gets a melee attack. That could be useful. Key damage projectiles. Hmm. Huh. Jeez, I don't know. So maybe not. Um, I could reduce his attack power, maybe, but I don't know. I feel like uh, I feel like we're just gonna have to murder him. We're just gonna have to get at him with skill, assuming I have enough. So a small one does half, basically. Jeez, it's been two hours. Holy shit. This is a long ass mission.
That was really good, though. If I had managed to dodge that, we might have had a pretty good chance of winning. Almost want to just like bring soul stones in on the equipment menu, and then use it to spam the weapon to kill him. It feels like that'd be kind of cheap to do, but at the same time, he's kind of a pain in the ass. I'm gonna give it a shot. Okay. I feel like at this rate I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get any Berseria yet. Which, you know, not that many people watch anyway, but still I wanna know what happens. Damn it.
Maybe smalls are the wrong to go because you have to use so many of them to get it up. It takes five, it looks like. Does it carry over though, I wonder? This is rough. There's no way to like save and quit, is there? Like to start over at that one and move on. Because I would really love to uh, start fresh, you know, on another day when I haven't been playing this for like two hours and 13 minutes. And this has been a long mission, so I don't really want to, like, you know, start over entirely. He's really good at swapping weapons, like going from dual sword to straight sword and back and whatnot. It's pretty good shit. It's a, a skill that I don't have because I've only used dual swords the entire time. Alright, I just want to look up. I want to see... Yo, save and quit. Uh, it only saves at shrines. Save points of shrines for all the missions. Um, to save where I am if I quit the game. You have to go back to the shrine. Okay. You know, I could, uh... I could live with that, I think. I'll give it another shot. Uh, but I could live with that. Because that shrine is right there. So, it's not like I'm that far off, you know? And we could start fresh another day. I know normally I do my best to complete them like the day of through it and whatnot, but it's been over two hours.
It's kind of like I want to keep him pinned against the wall. But it is hard to do that every time. Cheap shots in. Fuck. Okay, what I would really like to do is enchant my weapons and then go to town on them like this. That is garbage, though. <laughs> that is complete and total garbage. Ah, the damage over time from his fire attack kills me. Not the attack itself. That was a pretty good attempt, though. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go get my uh, my my bird back. I get my bird back and then uh, use a travel talisman. And we're gonna try it another day. So we'll try it on Friday. Because this, this fight is madness. Gotten pretty good at it, you know, considering the last couple of times. Uh, I'm just gonna slow him down first. I feel like it'd be wise to not uh not tempt fate doing this. Alright. So that's that. Pray. Oh, I see the auto save, so that's good. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna call it good. So I'm gonna take a quick break, get something to drink, all that, go to the bathroom, and then I'll be back with uh with some Berseria. So stick around if you'd like to see that. And uh, otherwise, I will I will see you all in a bit. I have to figure out what music to play. But I think, I think I know what I want to play. So just give me a moment and uh, we'll start that. 